Brian Baumgartner. Is going down. Watch this. Boom, boom, boom. Here we go. Alexander Hamilton. My name is Alexander, Alexander Hamilton. Hamilton. Oh, this is the wrong show. Sorry. Shoot. Oh. Hi. John hasn't had you on his show yet? I, I thought that he had asked me to sing Alexander, but then I realized I he don't got really Manuel sing. Lynn Miranda. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well. Um, yeah, and the first one he couldn't um he'd asked me, I couldn't do it. I was too busy. And me so too. he got he got Corel. Yeah, me too. So but um anyway, you look delightful. You're always do I look, just you're do a I treat look? you're a treat for the eye. You really are a treat for the human eye. You're just a you're just eye candy. We we both are. And you know what? I want to say that. Uh Brian, my dear old friend Brian. Thank God for the office for casting like odd looking people in lead roles. Do you know what I mean? Hmm. I never thought about that before. I'm I'm joking. Yes, that is true. Thank it gave God. us character guys some good roles. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Thank God. Allison Jones. Greg Daniels. Yeah, yeah. They're the casting director, Allison Jones. So I'm grateful for that. Um, you know, what are you wearing here? I'm trying to drink it. You got a lot of layers going it's, on there. It's very complicated. I'll be honest with you. We, we tried to do this last week for those of you who weren't with us. Yes. And the, I, and I almost screwed it up today. Yes. I, because how, how? I, were you sleeping in? No, I got into my car and then it was cold. So then I put on the sweatshirt and went out to my car and looked at the clock. I don't know how I remembered. And then I was like, oh, right, no. And then I came back inside. Where were you going? Well, you know, it's Stay very- inside. It's very important to shelter at home. You know, shelter, yes. in, shelter in place. Yes. yes, it is. Yeah, but I, I, had, I had to run and get one thing. I, I have gloves. I don't have them on. Do you have a mask? You know, I ordered, I, I, this is the thing that I'm very confused about. They said there's no masks, and then I ordered some, and I have no masks. <laughs> I, I don't, Wait. They're like, tomorrow you need to start wearing masks. But I, how do you wear one if you don't have one? And if you no, can't I, get one. Yeah. How, how do you get them? Uh, this yeah. I mean, it's a legitimate question. And by the way, I'm not really a bandana guy. So I don't. <laughs> well, wait, are you going to let your personal sense of style determine? No, your, I don't have uh, a bandana is what I mean. Oh, you I don't, don't have, have a bandana. I, I thought you said, like, I've got bandanas, but I'm not going to wear a bandana. No, I don't please. have a bandana. Here was my question. Does a, does a, because I, you know, as you know, I'm a fan of Green Bay. I've been to Green Bay. Would a, sto would a mat, would a stocking mat, would that work? Yeah, yeah. I have one of those, like a ski thing. You put it on like your neck and then thing. you can pull it up over, you know, I think right. that works. I had a friend who had some extra masks and honestly he sent me, he's like, he sent me like eight. I have like eight masks, but I actually, I have an N95. I have one of the fancy masks. You do? Where'd yeah. you get that? I got it like a couple of years ago. When oh. we made a, we made like an emergency kit for like earthquake and fires and something like that. It was the first time there was a fire, like big fires out here like three or four years ago. And so got different kind of stuff on batteries and all that kind of crap. And I had an N95 mask. I feel really fancy. Although if I wear it and take a picture, people would be like, fuck you, man. You're taking, you're hogging the masks. You're not giving it yeah. to the first responders, you asshole. That's what I would Probably. say, for sure. That's what yeah. you would say, right? Yeah. Um, Brian, you have two little ones. Yes. How are, How is it going down there in San Diego? And how are you, uh, how are you surviving this? And do you have any tips did you see the little gratitude exercise that we were I doing did. earlier i did maybe I you did. could share question one can you share a gratitude with us and then how that is going to affect your actions today specifically well, and then yeah. also i want to hear how how you've been getting on down there in san diego county well i i was thinking about that a lot and if there is a blessing i mean it's kind of a gratitude but one of the people brought this up about their friends and i am lucky enough to have lived a bunch as i know you have people in our business do like I've lived a bunch of lives in terms of doing theater and i'm from different places i'm from atlanta georgia and went to school in texas and lived in minnesota and new york and and 
I have been trying, and I think based on what you said today, want to try to take it a step further. Of I think we all get in habits. So it's yeah. like, these are the people you see. These are the people you talk right. to about yeah. this activity or that. As you yeah. know, I play a lot of golf. It surrounds yeah. that or friends. But really making an effort to connect with people that I don't normally connect with, that that I that I haven't really lost touch and we connect and things are kind of the same, but like reaching out and 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 ma trying to make a connection with those right. people. I've been trying to do that, but I know I can do even a, a better job of that. So you're grateful for the many different friend groups that you have yeah, from different occupations and being a student and working in theater and different yeah. geographic locations, et cetera. But you, so your action is you want to like spend extra time reaching out to the ones you don't normally reach out to as much. Right. Because, you know, you, you get as, um, as, you know, as you and I know, you know, you're working on a new project and you tend to really maybe hang out with those people extra, right. you know, mm -hmm. much, or like I said, I play golf. And so it's like, Oh, I'm seeing people that I play golf with, you know, usually once a week or whatever, but mm -hmm. it's like, Oh, you know, this person that I really care about that I went to college with who, you know, now lives in Chicago. I don't, I don't tend to reach out right. that much. And I'm traditionally uh, not great at returning messages as well uh, at times. So I, I just want to do a, try to do a better job of that. How come of, you're not good at that, Brian? Um, I mean, I can give my defensive answer. I, I, I think that there's, there's truth to it. <laughs> I think what I, I think What's when your I defensive get defensive answer. I think what, well, I think, I think when I, because it's also true. I get a message, right? Be it an right. email or a text message. Yes. And it's someone that I haven't talked to in a while. Yeah. And what I think is, oh, I really need time that it deserves. I really need to like give a good response or call or, you know what I mean? As opposed to just throwing yeah. something back. And then, <clears throat> yeah. because I get a lot of mess and then it goes down and then it goes down. And then by the end of the day, maybe it's not on the screen anymore. And, and then, all of a sudden, it's three weeks later, and you're like, God, I never even wrote I back. I never that did that. I wanted yeah. to. I yeah. meant to. It's also I, hard you have little ones. You have, How old are your kids now? Two and five. Amazing. That must yeah. be very challenging with them there at home. Do you have any relatives, or is it just you and your, and your wife? Yeah. It's, it's, yeah, it's just the kids. So and it's they, the four of you. Yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, it's difficult. Um, it's difficult because I have started to feel really, really bad for them. Like potentially they're the people who might be affected by this the most because I hmm. started thinking about a two-year-old, like their development is, they, they develop by the week or the, yeah. or the month. It's not yeah. years. Yeah. And really, you know, it's about socialization. It's about connecting with people and learning social cues and, and being out in the world, like that's what they're learning. They're not yeah. learning geometry, right? right? They and should so, be. Well, if you're parenting them right, you're teaching them geometry at two. I don't know it either. What am I? How am I supposed to teach if I don't know it? Yeah, yeah. Um, I, so uh, yeah, so they're not getting that whole social aspect. They're not getting to right. the play dates that they need and the contact and the friends and the all that stuff. Pushing for toys and learning that way right yeah right that's that's rough that's rough yeah so um do you have any uh hot tips uh for our viewers about uh, surviving this quarantine mental health tips how to make your life better uh things that have that have worked for you and celeste um i no i, I mean it's really for me it's... <laughs> no you got nothing no you I got mean, nothing for... For me, it's it's really day by day. I, I mean, the blessing is yeah. I'm gone so much. I'm I'm I, right. You know, I travel a lot. You know, particularly since the office left, a lot of work is out of town. I'm on planes a lot. I'm gone. I miss things. So I've really yeah. also been trying to appreciate spending time with them. And yeah. now, just like me leaving to go to the you know store for 
15 minutes was like, where are you going? Why are you, you know, you're not supposed to leave, you know, not, not like you're not supposed to be out because of COVID-19, like you're not supposed to leave us. And I'm like, when this is over, I think there's going to be a shock. Um, so I've been trying to do that. So that's a positive thing that you're, that, that your you kids know. are just getting their dad at home for weeks. And I do think that kids will have this experience with their parents where they're really excited for uh, their pa- yes. the, the fact that their parents are just, with them under our roof kids like that and in a lot of in a lot of ways yes um but so so that's been positive i've tried to do to do that Mm -hmm. but it's you know it's it's it is very difficult i mean i'm blessed in a way that that um you know i do have a a a house with room that that you know that they can get outside space yeah, that they can be outside. I feel blessed about that and, and good about that for them. But um, yeah, I think there there is, you know, unfortunately for me, I, I have started to focus probably too much on that. Like just they need to be socializing and they can't. And I'm not sure, um, you know, what to do about that. That's tough. But do you yeah. guys go to fa- on family walks? Uh, yes. Yes, we've been you doing. Wave at, we have, you wave at your neighbors. We have been doing walks, and um, I would say the best activity for them because they love it is um, swimming. Okay. Um, so we have been doing some some swimming, um, but you know it's it's cold right now, so not so much right this. It's cold minute. and rainy out here. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, but it's yeah, it's it's challenging, and for me too. You know, I I. Um, I derive a lot of mental health and relaxation um, uh, golfing. Really, I'm not not joking yeah. about that. Yeah. Like it, yeah. for me, it is a period of time that I can spend where I'm. So maybe this is like a tip of some kind, but unfortunately, I can't do the thing that I that I want. But where when I'm out playing golf, I find it very easy for me to just focus on that. Like mm-hmm, just mm-hmm. focus on this shot being in this moment on this. And so all of those like worries for me, those yeah. go, those go away. Sure. I don't think about, you know, taxes or, you know, you know, all of the things Emails. that kind of get yeah. us down mm-hmm, that get mm-hmm. you in your head. Mm-hmm. Um, and, and so that has been a for, for real. Like I know it's like oh golfing. Sorry, you can't golf. But it's like for me that is a way that sure. I kind of release. So what that, can you substitute, Brian? What can you substitute for golf? There's got to be tried, something else I've, you can do. I've tried walking, w- walking. Like you know, I don't want to say right. hiking, hiking. Right. That, that exaggerates it. But yeah, I've been trying to do that. My yeah. wife and I but, have been doing some online yoga classes. Yeah. I would that's love a, to see you do yoga. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's, I know. I would see. No, could you, you went, do a yoga class and videotape you, yourself doing you, yoga and send you, it to me? Yeah, you went from a suggestion for someone and then you went into a joke. That's what you just <laughs> did. So I acknowledge that. I will send you video of me doing yoga. It is not pretty. It is not pretty. I am a portly, ungainly, middle-aged man. <laughs> and... I when I go into Warrior Two, <laughs> Warrior Two into Triangle, it is not pretty. It is not a pretty sight. I yeah. am not. I'm not lean in the midriff. You know what I mean? No, I don't. I don't know oh. what you mean. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. It's interesting, you know, because I would say of anyone on the show. You, I was thought you were going to do it. Like you just, you would take your shirt off a lot. You know, you took I, your... I would and I do, and normally I would, but I just didn't feel right right now to take my shirt off. Like my giant belly, my giant white moon belly hanging right here on this Instagram live. Like people would accuse me of horrible things. I think. Right. Well, I have the. Um, I mean, again, I do do some swimming, but I, I, my golfer's tan is really significant I love very that. significant i love that any can we get a hint of that we get to see any of that 
Under your well, eight layers of clothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I can't. I mean, it's it'll be too awkward. It'll it would be too All awkward. Right. All right. Hey, yeah. um, Brian, thank you so much for coming by. Hey, human. Uh, you're such a delight, and it was a treat to see you, and I hope I get to see you more. This is why I miss my friends, and, like, I want to hug you. I want to hug you, and I just want to go, mm -hmm. and I want to go, mm -hmm. I know. And I go, mm -hmm. and I go, mm -hmm. no, 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 Brian. No, I don't want to go there. I don't. You see what you always... Okay, 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 okay. This is a family show. Goodbye, oh, Ryan sorry, Bond, sorry, sorry. partner. Bye, Rain. I love you. I love you so much, like a brother. And uh, I hope to see you again very, very soon. Thanks for stopping by the show. Come by again, okay? All right. Bye, humans. Bye, humans. Bye, Brian. What a delightful, delightful human being.